Hello everyone, my name's Nicolene and I'm a lecturer in health and social care. So I'm going to be talking you through today's taster, which is on health in pregnancy. Hope you enjoy it. So it's going to focus on the signs and symptoms of pregnancy and also the negative impact of lifestyle in pregnancy. First challenge is to make me a baby. So how are you going to do this? Well, you can either do this with a piece of hubba bubba chewing gum, just one, Play-Doh or blue tack, or anything that you can think of. So what I want you to do is just be creative and just make me a baby. And stick it on a piece of paper and give it a name. It would be really, really good if you sent me a photo of it too. So my email address is on the PowerPoint just in front of you. Right, so back to you. What I want you to think of now is what do you think the signs and symptoms of pregnancy are? So, what might you see? What might you feel? So how might somebody feel if they're pregnant? Or what might they see? Back to you. So how did you do? Did you come up with a list of possible signs and symptoms? Did you have on your list things like this period, feeling faint, eating more, changes in food habit, tender breast, feeling sick, going to the toilet more, missed periods, positive pregnancy tests. I hope you got a good range on your list. Well done. So my question to you now is, how do you think you should look after yourself in pregnancy. Make me a list. So think about things that you do in your lifestyle. Think about your diet too. Back to you. So the question is, how should you take care of yourself in pregnancy? So advisors advise expectant mothers to take prenatal vitamins and folic acid for the first 12 weeks. So this helps with the growth and development of the fetus and also prevents abnormalities. It is also advised that exercise, plenty of rest and a good diet is really good for the baby. Because don't forget you're at your feeding. What you eat and what you drink is going straight through to the baby, which is going to help the fetus grow and develop. So lots of fruits and vegetables, lots of water, lots of grains in your diet and lots of rest. Also, prenatal screening is essential. So one, this will monitor the fetus, monitor the growth and the development, and also detect any abnormalities. So what should you not do in pregnancy? So you shouldn't drink alcohol in pregnancy, take drugs or smoke. Advisors also say to cut coffee out totally or to cut back. Also, you need to watch your diet in pregnancy. So you have to make sure your eggs are well cooked, your meats are well cooked, and you've got to avoid certain foods because of food poisoning. You've also got to watch what kind of activities you do in, in your life, in your habits, and make sure the activities that you do do aren't putting you or your unborn fetus at risk. So, the danger of alcohol in pregnancy is that the alcohol passes through the mother's blood into the baby. The baby's tiny liver can't process the alcohol and therefore it harms the development of the fetus. Excess alcohol can cause miscarriage within the first three months. It can also lead to fetal alcohol syndrome when the baby's born. So, fetal alcohol syndrome could lead to restricted growth for the fetus. Facial abnormalities, learning disorders and behavioural disorders. So that just shows how dangerous it is and why you are advised not to drink alcohol throughout pregnant. So the dangers of smoking whilst pregnant is that the cigarette smoke restricts the oxygen to the baby and it makes the heart beat harder. 
So stopping smoking will reduce the risk of stillbirth, premature birth, breathing difficulties in the fetus, feeding problems and also other health problems. Stopping smoking will reduce low birth weight babies and it'll also redu reduce complications in the future just such as cot death and illness. Finally, the dangers of taking illegal drugs during pregnancy can increase the risk of birth defects, miscarriage, low birth weight and much more. So thank you very much for taking part in the Health and Social Care Taster today. I hope you enjoyed it on health and pregnancy and we hope to see you very soon. Bye!